All right, so in this video, I wanna show you guys how I do my seats and my leather trim in the car. And I do it with a, um, a conditioner. I see a lot of conditioners out there that are very, very expensive. And I've tried most of them and they last. The problem is that they don't last a long time. Um, and some of them are sold as a two pack where it's like a conditioner and a cleaner. Um, I have a solution that's an all in one. So a uh, little background history, um, I used to uh, manage a exotic leather shop and we would use this conditioner right here, it's called Big Four. It's a leather conditioner, it cleans, polishes, protects, and this is the best stuff. We use this on our $10,000, $15,000 jackets. I'll show you an example of some of the stuff we had. Um, this is a f one of my full alligator shoes. Um, this is what we use. This is 12 bucks a bottle, it lasts forever. Um, and if I'm gonna use this stuff on a $2,000 pair of shoes, not that that matters, but I'm just putting out a data point, um, then I'm gonna use it on the leather in my car. So what you do with this stuff is you just wanna shake it. It's very simple to apply, it's super easy. All we're gonna do now, with any conditioner, or any leather, or any car that you're doing, what you want to do is you want to test on an inconspicuous spot, just in case um, we have any issues with the dye, or uh, you want to see the result before you do the actual whole seat. Um, for this, I've already done it. Usually, you can do it on like, like you want to do it on the side or somewhere on the back will work. So, we've already cleaned our seat in terms of. Uh, just with the dry micro microfiber, we're just taking off all the dust and all the free dirt. This is just going to be a conditioning. This is not going to be a whole cleaning. There's other products if you want to actually restore the leather. This is just going to be, we're just doing leather maintenance right now. We're just keeping the leather clean and conditioned. We don't want it to dry out. You start seeing cracking on the sides of the bolsters and stuff like that. That's because you didn't condition the leather and it sits in the sun and it cracks. It's like skin. It needs to be moisturized. This is this is leather 101 whether it's a car seat or a, a couch or a wallet this should be, this it's the same protocol so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a little on here this brand new microfiber um, and then all we're gonna do is just rub on and the board right now what's happening is the leather is, is absorbing it and it's it might get a little darker at first just because it's getting wet but after it dries it should go it should um, go back to its uh, the leather should be uh, its color as you see the, when we post it when we put it on here it's just like a transparent it's like a little cloudy white conditioner so when we're putting it on we're not really seeing any color changes so all you're doing is this you're just doing a light coat hitting all the spots This isn't a crazy conditioner where you have to sit there and let it dry or, you know, got to put it in the sun for this amount of time or blah, blah, blah. This is very easy. If you look at our rag, these are already clean, so I don't really have a lot of transfer that's coming off. Um, we're not seeing any of the color of the seat. We're not rubbing that hard. We're using little force just to kind of rub it in. And then I'm going to switch to my dry side. So our wet side is here. We'll just open this. If you get this on your hand, it's actually gonna make your hand feel like you put lotion on it. Your hands are gonna become really smooth. And we're just gonna, a light buff. And you should do this every time. I recommend personally do it every time I wash my car. Um, it's up to you how crazy you wanna get with it. Um, at least one time a month is the minimum I would do. I do it uh, four times a month, two to four times a month, depending on when I wash the car. So that's it, I just did the bottom here. It is very smooth, super silky smooth. It's, it's actually crazy if you sit in this with um, like basketball shorts, like it feels so good. The seats, you can just tell when they're all oily, when the seats are all dirty and they're all oily, they, they're kind of, 
they're not as smooth they're holding a lot of dirt so much better now that we condition this now with this um, I'm gonna go ahead and let's see if we can turn this you're gonna be kind of crooked because of our mount let's see if I can fix this there we go so there's our shifter right there again I'm just gonna put it on the towel first I'm not gonna directly apply just put a little and I'm gonna hit here's our shift boot I'm also gonna hit um, this piece this is all leather basically I'm gonna touch all the leather trim in the whole car um, takes me about five minutes to do the whole car we're not really doing anything too crazy we're just conditioning this is like a one step it's a condition it's a clean um, depending on how dirty your seats are you might want to have two rags my uh, my stuff is kept up pretty well so I only need to do a one step Uh, we're going to do the steering wheel and uh, e-brake. I also touch the back seats. I only do them once a month just because no one sits back there. Um, they just get really dusty so we wipe all the dust off with a microfiber first with nothing, just a dry microfiber, dust it. It's really bad. I'll hit it with a vacuum with a bristle tip. And uh, I'll do one coating on the back. I don't. No one really sits in the back. No one actually has ever sat, sat in the back. Um, so that's pretty much it. So just do that every time you wash the car. Big four, super cheap. If it's made, if it's good enough for our um, for uh, super super expensive leather goods, designer um, jackets and stuff like that, then why wouldn't you use it in your car? All right. So that's it. And I'll have the link below where you can purchase is super cheap, it lasts forever. One bottle should last you a whole year. On the other stuff, one bottle will last you two or three washes because the way they have the spray nozzle in it, that's just the way it's, they uh, market it. So there you go, big four.